Hello everyone, and now it's time to, um, well, chase Flayman onto Undernet 3. Well, this is where Undernet 1 is. So I totally forgot how Undernet 1 is, so I'm gonna take a lot of guesses, but I believe it's somewhere in the middle. Now the, now the fun begins with a good, uh, what is this? The stronger viruses, oh my god. So that's a waste of time, because I can't really do anything. No! I'm just gonna shockwave for the kill, and then shockwave for the kills again. I'm just gonna try healing before I die. Damn it. Sad I won't be able to get any of those chips. So we're gonna have fun exploring this place. Damn it! Oh yeah, I got the double duty, and I got sensor one. So it's not that way. So is it here? No, it's not. It's not here, here either. Uh, Boomer. I guess the, these are the best chips to use. No oh boy. Damn it. Uh, Guts Man. Well, that. No, actually, I'm gonna have to hit the spiky first. And then Guts Man for the kill, double delete. I actually got a counter. So I got hit type K. So is it, wait. So I got 1200, so I guess it's right here down the middle exactly. Whoa, no. Well, I mean, Shockwave will be able to kill it anyway, as he hides behind that place. So goodbye, Mator. So is it to the left or is it to the right? No way. It's this way for sure. Yeah, I doubt I'm winning this battle the same exact way. But hey, you may never know, right? Actually, I, oh, actually I could. Never mind. So for the lead, I got another set to one, which is exactly the same chip I got. So that's it. So I right, actually have to go through the middle. It's not that bad. I'm gonna two slightly more confusing. So hopefully I do not end up going to the Undernet Square by mistake, because I believe Undernet Square is actually led by here. But I don't know. So I kind of, like, uh, trapped myself. Sort of. Will I be able to escape? Well, it's not really that much. It's not really trapped. I mean, like, I'm gonna get hit by the jellyfish regardless, because I don't have... Because it does, like, a wave attack. Which I can't avoid. Like, if I had another enemy on that field, like, if I didn't kill that bunny off so quickly, like, I'd be able to use it as, like, a, a sort of, like, a shield. By sort of, like, a shield, I mean, like, a shield. So eight. What is this? Alright, we are now on under three and Mega Man sensing something a different power than before. As that Navi is following us. Where the hell did he go? He was only like five steps behind us anyway. Unless Undernet Square is actually not in Undernet 2, is it? No, it's not. I believe it's through that guy. Don't know why I said it was through under it too. Unless I get confused with like games. No! How the hell did I run into that? It's 
So we have the spiky and then I got 120 HP. Sure, why not, right? And we're actually, I think we're actually right there at him. So I believe Flameman's right here. No, no, not right here. Very soon. No, an earthquake happens and then cracks the floor. I wonder what happens if they like fall off the path. Like they're falling through the internet. So I get this mystery data, which has HP memory, which is really cool. So I have no choice but to go to that guy, to that guy. Hi, I don't fight. Why are you using fishy tooth? Wait. Haha. Z cannon, baby. Z cannon. Goodbye. As I'm going to, um, I'm going deeper, of course. So down or up, up or down, I have no idea. And now I honestly don't remember where other net square is. Like I'm just like making like blind guesses. But it doesn't matter, right? Don't you feel it? Ever since we came to this area, we've been watched. Yeah. We get it. That guy's following us. Teasing us. Like, No, wait. No, that's what down in the square is. Found it. Right there. Right where those arrows are going, what, like, right and up. Or sort of. However you want to place it. Right next to me. Like, if I, there was, like, a, a panel right in front of me, I'd be able to go through it. That's what down in the square is. So it's an under that three. So, I mean, if these torches of fire don't mean anything, like... Um, I don't know, a boss fight, or even more importantly, uh, like, and you know, more or less just a boss fight. Okay, if a guy he dashes really fast and really, well, just really fast. Goodbye, um, 33. Let's hold on. Actually, um, am I ready? Actually, I'm probably not even ready to fight this guy. So, I will, um, how many attacks do I have? You know what? I'm ready. So, I'll use a full energy. So, I'm not, I'm wood style. I'm not scared of you. Sure, you're fire. Sure, you have advantage. Sure, it doesn't matter. I'm Mega Man. Main character. Okay, let's try to dodge his attacks. Nice. No, don't want to get hurt too quickly. This guy's gonna be really annoying. Not really fast. Cause I really hate like how the candles like support him and stuff. Oh shoot. No. Oh, whatever, it doesn't matter. Nope. Got you. Uh actually I'm really close to actually I'm gonna actually use a plasma. Damn it! Actually, it's this is not that bad, but I just go waste his turn using one guts man. So towards the end, um, well, I actually have an advantage. No way, my learning you hurt me. Guts man, blah. 
Because I have dash attacks. Because I make a line right in front of me. Oh, yeah. Mm -mm. Of course. I really don't care if you heal yourself, because I'm actually going to use this boomerang. Use the grass stage as a, just as a waste of space chip. Damn it. Wow. You still got hurt? So now, time for the ultimate thing. A, B, C. Z cannon! No way. Screw your candles. What? Oh, come on. Whoa, that was close. Oh. Oh, oh, that's... Yeah, this is horrible. Oh, my God. How much health do the candles have? Seven? Okay. Because I will be using a lot of Mega Buster now. No! Whatever, it doesn't matter. Ah. Oh. Whatever, I need this combination. Nope. As this is my only chance to win now, is to. Well, use this. And one more charge? No! Why? Oh boy. So I have no chips. So I'm forced to use my charge. You know, I use that. I don't care. I'll take the hit. Got you. Oh yeah, Flame Man, in your face. He's not really a threat though. Freaking too long. So Flame Man, you know, is like, I'm not gonna be easily beaten now, you know, but someone else is coming. Who the hell is that? Who's gonna Completely obliterate the shit out of Flame Man. So now I'm gonna fight him. As I got Zeke and in. Yeah. As I can't do anything to him because he has a freaking aura. So yeah. So it's one of those fights where you lose, but I'm, you know what I like doing? I just like stalling to see how, how far I can possibly go. No idea why. Damn it. Alright, so I'm just gonna lose, so I really don't care. Cause I don't think I have, did I not put undershirt on? As Bass is gonna finish me off. As this guy is gonna come randomly. It's like, yeah. Uh, so this guy's actually very important instead of some stalker. So he's gonna use the Dark Aura. As Bass is not even interested, he's just gonna like, destroy the. No, no, never mind. So Willie is actually gonna call back um, Bass as he's like, I have four Tetra codes. Oh no. So I'm gonna wake up eventually and then I'm just gonna jack out. I guess we're gonna have to go back to Psylap to figure out if our dad's okay or not. But obviously he's the main character, so he should be right. Okay? No idea. Okay, I know what's gonna happen, but still. No, so I'm not there. Like, my favorite part of the game is coming up right now. So, the guy's like, what are you doing here? And then, like, he's gonna make him go to the hospital, so, as he collapses. 
So that's the second person, no, third person. Damn hosp. Why would you put a hosp on this game? So we're just gonna go home. But before I go home, every time there's a sad part, we have to cheat, right? Yes, because cheating is so much fun, isn't it? So this guy wants to gamble. The minimum bet is a thousand zennies, so. Save game, of course. Nope, got that wrong. Or, I actually got that right. Haha. Save game once again. Is it this one? Nope. It's actually this one up here. Ha. Damn, I'm gonna like freaking get a lot of zennies off this. So I actually got it right for once. I was like, I don't think this is even possible. Like, I mean, it is possible. Like, who would get this much luck? To do this without using save states like myself, like, like I have to cheat. It's like playing like the casinos, which I, yes, yeah, so I bankrupted it and I got two hundred fifty-six thousand zennies. Wow, that is amazing. So I'm just gonna buy like every chip for no reason now. Like I said, I'm gonna go home. Uh, ACDC Town? No, ACDC Town, don't even know where I live anymore. So, let's go. Oh, it's about Jack in, but we're gonna put save and get ready for bed as Willie's laughing as he got all the tet tetracos. So, Drill Man's gonna come out and he's gonna, like, he's gonna be, he's gonna be like, yeah, hey, get out for me now. As the land's okay, but he's been absent for three days because his father's been injured. So they're gonna visit me as I'm like emo. As land's feeling really, really down. Why? You're a hero, land? Oh, is it because they. Ah, oh, it's because he helped them. It's like he knew Mr. Match was gonna be bad, but I wonder who this is now. So it's Chad. <laughs> Are you gonna rust me? No. So now Chad's like releasing everything to Lan about how what Willie wants to do. I mean, but by now you already should figure out what he wants to do. Little by little. So child's like, okay, so we're gonna go visit our father now. Uh, beach. And then we're gonna go help out Chad, because this is like the best part about. This is the best part of the game. This is like the game's climax. This is on the third floor. I believe he's in Yai's room. No, third floor, second floor. Yeah, okay. I, I, I go. I believe it's in Yai's room and like still, but still. Uh, so there's that guy, Sean, who's actually. Spoiler alert. You have not played Mega Man Battle Network 2, but I'm gonna shout, shout out anyway. He's actually the leader of the Net Mafia group called Gospel. More or less, he's like the the head of the evil guy in uh, Mega Man Battle Network 2. I just thought about the Ultimate Navi Bass, which he's also tried creating, also, but yeah. So what does uh, the dad want? So more or less I just told dad everything, my dad everything, as uh, he's like, oh the virus breeder, 
Oh, I love this part. This is like the awesomest part, but I kind of don't want to do it because I have to give up the bug frags. Unless you could just have the virus as pets. Like randomly, I don't know the exact places, but randomly you'll find like... I mean, they're in fixed locations, but like you can find like viruses that that you fight, but like won't decide not to leave, so you just send them there, then you can use them as a battle. Um, it's right there, but I'm just gonna go to Chad now, see what he actually wants. So what's the mission, Chad? So, other than that, it's something called a ranking. Okay, I'm, I, I kind of realize where it's gonna go. More or less, it's just, uh, yep, but we're gonna try to influence the ranking Navies, but we, we're trying to go to the top Navy, which is S. And that's really it. So let's we're ready to infiltrate the undernet. So I, I believe I know where this is gonna be a nice end for this video. At the start of the undernet again. Like I said, this is the coolest part about this game. Right there, almost through the other net. Get that mystery of a hundred zennies. Celebrate. Uh. Oh, I do have undershirt. Oh, wait, I want to remove it. I want to move it. Remove. Wait, wait a second. Screw it. I'll do it later. Actually, I think by now there's going to be actually a job request where I want to expand my memory for an Avi customizer. But I'll just do that later as we're going to go to the other net square next time and infiltrate them. Infiltrate the other net Navi. So, yeah, I'm out. Goodbye.